good morning you guys so i know i look like this but in like give me about an hour i won't look like this no more so i am vlogging today and i wanted to just do basically like a day in the life of a mom of three kids i just wanted to do a day in the life for you guys see how hectic it could be juggling three kids so just a quick side note so i just fed junior um he just ate and he's been a little fussy so I gave him some gas medicine so I gotta change his diaper right now because he actually pooped so um yeah today I will be going to my six weeks doctor's appointment to get my six week checkup to see if I'm healing fine and everything is okay and also to get my birth control patch um yes you guys I am going back on birth control because hubby will not get me again like I am done birth control of choice that I wanted was the IUD but my um OB doesn't do IUD IUDs he uh, she does like <sighs> patches and pills and I hate pills because I never remember to take them so I'm on the patch I'm going back on the patch which is the ultra ever um patch so that is where you keep it on for three weeks and take it off for one week to have your menstrual so that's that's uh, that works for me and i remember that so um let me go ahead and change junior change prince real quick and then give this little boy his juice Baby Prince is all clean, but but now clean diaper. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and give feed this little boy. Well, not him, but my other son. Ooh, can you turn around for mommy? Hmm. Want to turn around for mommy? I don't think he wants to turn around. <laughs> kind of wanted you guys to see him. Look, boo. Hmm, you don't want to look, I know. Principal. Principal, look. Look, pumpkin. No, not that way. <laughs> don't eat me. But, um, yeah, let me go ahead and feed this little boy, and I will come back when I am about to head out the door and like, get him dressed and stuff like that. So, um, this little one goes in his crib. Uh, 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 So, little man here is crying. I had to get him real quick. Say hi. <laughs> what is that? What is that crying at your mouth? It's a lot of drool. <laughs> so, um, what I'm going to do right now is just pack his diaper bag. So, when I'm ready to go, um, his diaper bag will be packed. The only thing I have to do is just put his bottles, which are already pre-made, uh, because hubby and I just make like when we make his bottle we make like at least four or five bottles and just put them in the fridge Especially at night time. So So we don't have to get up and make bottles. They're already made. We just have to put them in a bottle warmer So he already has some bottles um, in the fridge. I think it's, he has like two left in the fridge So I'm gonna take those with me when I'm leaving since he's already been fed. So he's good He just needs a little bit of mommy love right now That's all I just got to pack my diaper bag like I said and then get 
his clothes and my other son's clothes together. <laughs> mommy tastes good? Hmm? Mommy tastes good? No? Okay. Mommy don't taste good, I know. Alrighty, boo. Yes, pumpkin. Okay, I'll, I'll come out there in a minute. Okay. So, this is just my diaper bag, and this is a book bag type of diaper bag that I got from Walmart. I paid $18 for it, and I just love it so much. So, what I have in my diaper bag is just six diapers. I always make sure I bring six diapers for baby boy. And here I just have his wipe container with all his wipes and just a Ziploc bag with some extra clothes for him. And I put it in a Ziploc bag just in case anything spill in my bag, his stuff will be good. He has two shirts, a washcloth, some pants in here. And I also have a bib for him. So one other thing I have in this diaper bag is just a change in mat. And I just keep that in a diaper bag just in case. So, baby boy is chilling right now. He was just asleep, but he's up. So now is the time. Sorry about the noise. Now is the time where I get in the shower. Oh my gosh, you guys. So, I gotta tell you. Being a mom, you have to do half-assed jobs of stuff, like Little man here crying. What's up? What's going on? What's going on? Here you go. Okay, I know. So at this point, he wants me to pick him up. So, I mean, when y'all a mom, y'all gotta take like five, seven minute shower tops. Like, you just gotta wash the necessities. And I ain't gonna tell y'all what the necessity is. Y'all should know what that is. A little man don't wanna be by himself or he don't wanna lay down. He won't be picked up. And I got to rush out of the shower to do this. Pick him up. Y'all, the struggle is real.
So you guys, I am dressed and ready. Um, so I didn't do nothing too much. Like I said, um, I'm going to show you guys my outfit in a little bit, but um, I just have my hair in a high, very, very high ponytail, if that's what you want to call it. And I just slay my edges. And my makeup is very simple, very simple, y'all. A neutral eye, just got a little pop of shimmer right there, and a pink lip very neutral and I did slay my eyebrows that I did do slay my eyebrows if you guys want to see this makeup look thumbs this video up um I just have some gold earrings that's the only accessory I got going on and let me got, give you guys a full length of length check of my outfit So I'm sitting in here waiting for this doctor to get here. After that, I've had me sitting in the waiting room for about an hour. But you know what? I'm not complaining because I really need to get this ball on the road. As far as knowing if I'm cleared to go back to work, she should be in here in a couple more minutes. I may not vlog when she's in here, but after I leave and then get in the car, I'll just tell you guys the update of what's going on and what she says. And all that stuff so yeah so y'all um i am just leaving the doctor's office and um everything went well she just had me do a pap smear so this is my first pap smear for 2017 and she just checked me to make sure i'm healing fine and she's like i'm good i got the okay to go back to work i also got um my prescription for my birth control patch but I told her I wanted to get the implant which is what they put inside your um inside your arm and it's good for up to three to five years so she was telling me not to do the IUD because that's giving people like that's giving females infections now and they're recalling them so she told me to go ahead and do the implant which is what they just put the little thing in your arm and you're good for five years you don't have to worry about it for the next five years so I got a referral for that I did get some backup birth control patch to hold me down until I get a early um, appointment for the implant but um yeah that is it I haven't ate anything all day as you guys seen my day has been hectic um, I have to go drive pretty much like a 40 minute drive right now to go link up with my cousin so um, when we link up, I'm going to just get something to eat because I haven't eaten anything all day and I'm starving. But I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for staying tuned. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for enjoying. If you did enjoy this vlog and want to see more like this, thumbs this video up. Also, if you want me to do a makeup look on this, thumbs this video up as well. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, put that down below in the comment section. And I'll get back to you guys with an answer. Um, if you guys are my first time subscribers, welcome. If you guys are old, don't forget to hit that bell next to that subscribe button. That will notify you guys every time I upload. I love you guys so much for watching and enjoying my videos. Thank you for rocking with your girl. Once again, I'm Goldilocks. I'm out.